Jesus is king. Jesus you is king. You have to king, answer bro. to him one day. I know. And Jesus can be like, you're I'm in, working on it. You're, you, in, you're hey, in a temple with hey, sodomites. Even Jesus had to go to hell before he could take over. But he conquered death. You think you're going to conquer death like Jesus? I'm not going to conquer. I don't know. But you got to you got to get into you got to get into it before you can fix it. I feel like I'm sense. giving you a hard time because I'm in, I was an initiated European Rosicrucian. I needed work, so these people helped me find work. But man, the stuff they're teaching was like meditative practices, and they taught me uh, about afterlife, and it's very different from the Bible. What, same with masonry, which you guys talk about spirit world. You buy into what masonry teaches about spirit world. You guys say that if someone's addicted to fentanyl, someone who died, their spirit went inside you and is gripping for the drug, is addicted. You guys believe in a bunch of stuff that's identical to the Bible, but it's inverted always. And you guys never talk about salvation. There's no Freemason who ever talks about salvation. No. Yeah, that doesn't really How do you get saved up. as a Freemason? That, that doesn't come up. Um, it's terrifying. Yeah. I would say... If there's anything useful in masonry, it would be the seven, seven things that you need to study. Seven liberal arts and sciences, which are grammar, rhetoric, logic, arithmetic, you mean spell casting. geometry, Just say spell music, casting. Say your Phoenician, and astronomy. Phoenician spellcasting in bro, English. Bro, they're telling you. That is gematria and they're, numerology. They're telling you that that creates everything. The, the way that you write your words, the way that you uh, inflect your words, the logic, the arrangement at which you put things, uh, then numbers, math, arithmetic, and then geometry, that's the biggest one, that's also another representative of the G. Like, you go into sacred geometry, you're using all these things. They're literally telling you how, how the world is, is created. Yeah. And, and this is why... No, it's funny, you guys say how the world's created, but none of you can actually understand it. You pretend. Like, yeah. what is sacred geometry? The thought patterns of God, like you think a Mason understands God? No, he doesn't. 